Hey everyone, this is Alex or Polymomochi, and today I have a tutorial showing you how to make this functional working Koi capsule or gashapon machine out of polymer clay and plastic. So for the template I'm using some graph paper where I cut out the sides, front, back, and the bottom. And just to make sure, the front and back has a little bit longer sides to account for the thickness. And I also have a bundle of sticks that I taped together because we're going to make the tube that kind of spins. So to make the spinning handle part, I'm going to take some flattened clay and I'm wrapping around the sticks. And I'm blending in the sides together. And you want to make sure that it's longer than the bottom, so it has to go from one end to the other and then some. And then what you want to do is you want to cut out a square within the pipe so the gashapon or the toy can fall into it. Then you want to carve out the other templates and you want to make two of each, so two front back pieces, two side pieces, and two top and bottom pieces. For the back side, you want to have a strip of clay and wrap it around where the circle would be on the bottom so it kind of serves as like a holding place for the tube. The final modification is that on the top, you want to add a strip of clay around it to make it a lid. So to make sure that the toy capsule will fall directly into the hole, you want to make a total of five ramps. So we're making ones on the sides the one on the bottom and two at the top and you just want to make sure that it fits into your toy capsule shape. So for the display part I'm taking some plastic from packaging and I'm taping on some graph paper onto it and I made sure it was 16 squares long because that's the perimeter of my capsule and then I'm scoring it every four squares. Now once your clay sides are baked, all you want to do is start gluing them together. So I'm gluing the bottom with one side and then the ramps. Then I'm gluing on the back side, making sure that the little circle hold place is on the inside. Then I'm gluing on the front side. Now for the tube we made, I just kind of made a random button with arrows just to cover up that hole. And on the inner part of the tube, I just got a scrap piece of clay, this is a cube, and I'm gluing it on the inside just to make sure the capsule doesn't go into the tube itself. And I'm placing the tube inside my machine, making sure it spins. Then I'm placing the plastic part on top of the toy capsule. And I'm putting some random balls that I made using half circles put together. Filling the machine up and I'm spinning it. And as you can see it actually comes out. It's not the perfect design because the balls should be a little bit bigger so only one can come in at a time because it gets really stuck easily. But overall it's a really fun project and it works. And I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. Thank you.